A was the start of Tennessee's tax-free weekend. Many families getting ready for the start of school took advantage of that. News tells Robin Esperg joins us now with the details on that. Robin? Stores were packed for the start of Tennessee's tax-free weekend. Shoppers say that buying different items can be expensive, so this helps. Parking lots at stores were packed for the start of Tennessee's tax-free holiday weekend. Over at Office Depot, people like Adam Scales and his family were taking advantage of this and getting a head start on back-to-school shopping. He was also getting supplies for his daughter's classroom. Um, she's an English teacher, so there's a lot of supplies that don't uh, get bought unless it's bought by outside individuals, parents, or relatives. The tax rate varies by county, but experts say people usually save 7% on purchases. Tax-exempt items include school supplies, computers, and clothing. But depending on the price, it might not be tax-free. Well, you're just thankful that Tennessee does tax-free weekend. People shopping for back-to-school clothes say it can be expensive, so every little bit helps. Well, I had received a 20% off coupon and realized it was tax-free weekend, so I wanted to take advantage of both of those. Stores like Fleet Feet are also seeing customers come in because of the tax-free holiday. It started off as uh, back-to-school shopping, but I think if you really market it toward just your normal consumer, that's where you get most business. So if you target it that way instead of just targeting back-to-school, I think you're a lot more likely to get more business. For shoppers, this comes at the perfect time. And some good deals because of not only the sales, but then there's been the other parts with uh, the tax free, plus the sales, plus a lot of availability of everything. So it's been really good. The tax free deal will end on Sunday. Live in Chattanooga, Robin Esbrook, News 12 Now.